Markets regulator SEBI on Tuesday said it has recovered pending dues worth 6.57 crore rupees from Sahara India Real Estate Corporation, its chief Subrata Roy, and others in the case pertaining to flouting norms in issuance of optionally fully convertible debentures. The Securities and Exchange Board of India, SEBI, said in its recovery order. In view of the payment of the amount of 6.57 crore rupees due under the certificate, the said certificate is hereby completed, the amount included interest and other charges. Watching this video will help us gain a better understanding of this situation and the factors that led to the imposition of this penalty. For violating regulatory norms in the issuance of OFCDs, the regulator in December ordered the attachment of bank and DMAT accounts belonging to Sahara India Real Estate Corporation, now known as Sahara Commodity Services Corporation, Subrata Roy, Ashok Roy Chaudhary, Ravi Shankar Dubey, and Vandana Bhargava in order to recover 6.42 crore optionally fully convertible debentures. This total was inclusive of interest, as well as all costs, charges, and expenses. Following the failure of these entities to pay the 6 crore fine that had been imposed on them by SEBI in June 2022, the recovery proceedings were initiated against them. The case centers on the issuance of OFCDs in 2008 and 2009 by Sahara India Real Estate Corporation and Sahara Housing Investment Corporation. Without adhering to the various procedures intended to protect the interests of investors in relation to public issues as prescribed by the norms, the companies raised capital by means of the public offering of securities in the form of OFCDs. This allowed them to circumvent the norms. According to SEBI, the two companies allegedly solicited subscriptions for the OFCDs from members of the general public all over the country in order to raise money for themselves, but they failed to provide these individuals with sufficient information regarding the risks associated with the instruments. It is alleged that the issuance was carried out in violation of the regulations governing the SEBI's ICDR, Issue of Capital and Disclosure Requirements, and PFUTP, Prohibition of Fraudulent and Unfair Trade Practices. In conclusion, SEBI's recovery of pending dues worth 6.57 crore rupees from Sahara India Real Estate Corporation and its chief Subrata Roy serves as a reminder to all entities to adhere to regulatory norms in their dealings. The issuance of optionally fully convertible debentures in violation of regulations governing the SEBI's ICDR and PFUTP led to the imposition of a penalty and the subsequent recovery proceedings against these entities. It is crucial for companies to ensure that they provide sufficient information to investors regarding the risks associated with their instruments to protect their interests.